Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. It ain't nothing personal, it's just business. Now, uh, also, uh, I'm a civil rights activist where I can make shit get national, global, when I find a civil rights violation. So I don't do no verbal gymnastics, nor mm. do I do no uh, Adolf Twitless shit on the internet talk. I'm going to come and hurt you. I'm the verbal assassin in this game, but I'm going to hit you where it hurt. See, so with Charleston White is, I know Charleston White probably better than anybody outside of these brothers. So they look at it, well, he's still around Charleston White and this and that. Let me clarify how this game go. This man know Charleston White and probably grew up and know his mama, sister, brother, and everybody else. And this go for the nation. Over this time period of this culture, over 50 years, because of the segregation recreated by our own and the franchisides, that's the killing of one own brother and sister, or either by friendly fire when you hear about people get killed with a gang member, so whoever do it, and it was an accident. Mm -hmm. So at the end of the day, I always say it's easy to kill a stranger. Hmm. It's very easy to kill a stranger, and that's what happens out these streets. A lot of guys don't know each other. But back to Charleston White, I have concerns with his presence when it comes to being around Chip. I'm a board member on uh, Youth Mixed Martial Art with Cynthia, uh, Big U's uh, cousins, and his uh, uh, other cousins as well as other champions. But our job is to identify people that could be a threat to children because the athletes are uh, children six to 18. Uh, uh, and it's, you know, Charleston White to say, see, I do fact checks on what they say. Mm -hmm. See, we doing fact checks because a lot of people, he's not a builder, he trying to build itself. So somebody got to step to him. He had stepped to him, I could step to him. Like I say, he know I've been here all week. He can come tomorrow. I got till <laughs> seven o'clock sundown tomorrow. And he can step to the mic and let's see, because I heard him say uh, he got characters. That's who he is, the character. I know that's a character. Those are clowns. But then you got characteristics. That's what he say. So now let's look at Charleston Reich's characteristics. A man that admitted, talk about him or me when we talk about our past, but when he talk <laughs> about his past, he talk about raping a woman. But y'all accept that. I don't. So I don't talk about it. We're going to be about it. Uh, we also know Charleston White was bragging about going to Memphis to a school where he all of a sudden admitted, oh, I ain't going to mention the school. But that didn't get past my ear. I want to know why he didn't, and it's a reason why, because he wouldn't have been allowed there. So I'm putting everybody on notice. If he's around a child where he's anywhere involved, I'm going to hold you responsible if something happened to that child. Now, tomorrow we're going to have a show where Charleston uh, threatened and was restrained from jumping on a 16-year-old. That's coming out tomorrow. And since he liked to tell if we wanted to, that's charges of assault. And I don't think he's ready. But I ain't going to punish him like that. Maybe, maybe not. That's <laughs> up to them. But at the end of the day, it ain't about Charleston Wright. It's a moral issue here. Mm -hmm. He got a man that has been uh, uh, on the internet out his own mouth again, showing his penis. My mom want to be a porn star. Uh, I show my penis. We got that. He called a child a faggot. You know about it. Well, you, when you say I know about it, here, here, here's the spiel. You know, I heard what had happened. Okay, I well, wasn't that's there. What I, but you but know. I heard about it. That, but but at the end of the day, I, I wasn't there, so I can't no, just no, put my finger on it. But, but I, gotta, I, I gotta say this. When uh Charleston uh because he it's been kids over here that he had uh brought over here as I told you before, and when they got out of juvenile, and these was teenagers. But at any rate, and I wouldn't pick the teenager up because I had when spoke at the juvenile to these kids. So I definitely don't I, I don't regret doing it. But I uh. can say this, um, and I will say this: when when he talked about raping a white girl, he always clarified the fact that he was a young kid. Wait, hold, hold on, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I ain't I gotta no, say hold on it. He hold was a young on. kid. Ain't nothing you can say after that. He was a that. young kid. I wouldn't give a damn if you said you was to hold it, bro. Hold on, bro. 
hold your horses. So if he's young, no, no, it don't no, matter. No, no. He's saying they ran a train on the white girls. I've heard you him say You know how it. many people I ever heard say that they raped somebody in my goddamn life? And I've been around rapists from the Hillside Strangler to the USC rapists. Nah, motherfucker. Let me let me let me help you out. Go ahead. Let me help you out. <laughs> no, that let ain't throw, no, let, let, let me throw him a right a life rap. I'm just I'm just having the let conversation. Me, no, 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 let me throw him a life no, rap no, real quick. You good? Sure. Watch this. Um, it's it's in it's in people like our DNA. Institution prison. When you didn't been to prison, you don't even have to go to prison to be a real to be on. I know where he at. You know when he talk like that. You can feel it come out of him, the energy come out of him. In prison, you better not even smell like you didn't rape somebody. That don't go down. Mm -hmm. You hear me? You better not shit. <laughs> Your name better not, not even come up on it. it. Not Your name better not even come up on it. You can't take that back. Can't take it back, bro. That's like I heard you fucked the punk. You can't get that back. You did that. Hey, that, that just something that's gonna stick. But when you say things like that and you play with the children, I got an injury to a child on my on my record for sure whooping a 16, for fighting a 16 when I was 17. <laughs> the 17 was was bigger than them. <laughs> and I was smaller than Charleston. You hear me? Yeah, but um, just because the big man had a black eye and he was 16 and I was 17, I got charged in as an adult. One thing you can't play with is rape. We don't play that. That's unacceptable, bro. It, it, Particularly it, I mean, when they know no being this. around don't, children. Don't do what's oh, yeah. I, 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 I see what you can be around. You can't play that. You can't build build around, play, you can't you can't around you can't children. You can't do that, yeah. man. Yeah. That's I, the bottom I, I, line. I, I fuck with Charleston, but he that. know. But watch this. I'm going to tell you something about Charleston. He'll tell you himself. Had I said something like that, he'd have, he'd have ran to the moon with it. Oh, yeah. You can't do that. You know, you don't. That's one thing, you know, mentally that you can't take out of a real one when you say it. So I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I'm so, not. So because he said that he raped hard, that's hard. pretty much oh. everything else is out the door. Oh, you can't nah, do that. You can't do that, bro. That's yeah. a lot, E. Saying you actually took something like that from somebody. <laughs> you can't, can't, can't do that. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.